Well, good morning and welcome to the beautiful surroundings of Cabroni Forest here in Ross Trevor. Another park run done. People are just leaving. Bye, 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 bye. That's Willie. Willie, who is uh, the fastest marathon man in Uri and one of the organizers of the park run. But this morning, Brenda is here. Good morning, Brenda. Good morning, Jake. You're very welcome along very to Ross Trevor and to Cabroni Park Run. Beautiful location. It's, and a, it's a challenging run. It's the most challenging run yet, so it is. Um, lots of hills, uh, lots of rain, lots of puddles, um, and a variety of terrain to, to cover, but a beautiful, beautiful setting. And lovely to come through Narnia. Isn't it? It's, it's very special uh -huh. there, isn't very, it? Very, very special. Um, lovely to touch Narnia's door. Pick up on one word that you said. Yet. Yet uh -huh. means Yet there's been means... some before mm -hmm. and maybe some to come. Uh -huh. uh, tell me about the challenge that you have set yourself. The challenge is I'm uh, in the Department of the Early Childhood Studies degree at Stranwell's University okay. and as part of the Early Childhood Studies degrees uh, 21st anniversary I've taken on the challenge um, hopefully with some staff and some students uh, who have come last week and will continue to come. Brilliant. Um, 21 park runs around Northern Ireland which ties in with uh, a module in health and well-being to try and get more people uh, out running more often. Excellent. I mean, it, it is really uh, a great opportunity, the park runs for people. I mean, this time last year, I did my first park run on the first one here and the first week of December. This one started the last week of November. And up until that, I hadn't done any running at all. It's it's a friendly environment. Yes. You can challenge yourself and pace yourself. But what other ones? What was your what was your first one? Did you start off the first, Belfast ones? The, the first one was um, my local one in Antrim. Okay. Um, we I belong to Pace Running Club in Antrim. Oh, so you're, um, you're, and you're, I, you are an athlete. <laughs> no, no. I, well, I, I have done my 50th park run not so long ago. So I started off like like yourself with a uh -huh. Couch to Five program. Yeah. And um, it's it's to get out and meet so many people it's it's just such a wonderful environment met some wonderful friends we all call each other the soul sisters okay and we all travel around uh, and have lots of social activities afterwards as well brilliant so you did Antrim, did where, Antrim. Where the second one we did was um, uh, Newcastle okay uh, Castle Well and it's just started I believe it's it's, it's yes, flatter than here, here? it's flatter it's uh, around the lake Beautiful. Uh, once around the lake, uh, beautiful, lovely, soft terrain and flat the whole way around. <laughs> and the third one was Cumber, which tied in with the British Psychological Society's um, week of mental health and well-being. Right. So after the, the Cumber Park run last week, we had a talk um, about health and running and the benefits of running for right. your mental health. Okay. And was that part of the park run or separate? It was from after it? the park run, but the park run uh, in Cumber accommodated. The, Brilliant. The talk. That's fantastic. Okay, so Rostrever today, have you have you got an itinerary that you've planned well, ahead, kinda, or is it kinda, week by week? Kind of, maybe week by week, or sometimes two weeks in advance, uh -huh. um, because I have to fit in my own family uh, commitments at the weekend and the Saturday morning as well. But we posted up on Stranmore's website uh, a couple of days beforehand on their Facebook page and on their Twitter feed. Okay. And nobody came with you this week. Um, I have my my daughter came with okay. me, and another member Hi, from from Pace Running Club came okay. with Brilliant. me. But hopefully, uh, the closer I come to Belfast again, uh -huh. the more staff and so students. We're not going to see us. too many of them down in Enniskill, are we? Well, you know, <laughs> hopefully, certainly around Belfast, and we'll either end with the Ormo Park Run, which is close to Strambolus or Queen's Park uh -huh. Run. So that'll be one of the two final ones. We should try and tie in with like minded people in the area if you can give them sort of two weeks' notice, other mm -hmm. people who might be doing similar courses and things that's, like that. That's Tell you a bit about your intention. course. It it's an early childhood studies degree program. Um, it's a three year full time, and we also take part time students on, okay. and they uh, study a wide range of topics from child development, uh, children's learning intentions, um, play, and they um, do uh, foundations in social and developmental learning, health and well being modules. Uh, dissertations and then they go out in placement two days a week uh, uh -huh. to um, facilitate what they've learned in class uh -huh. then in placements. Well, it would be an opportunity for them to come along, be inspired by this and then to get other people involved. In and to get runs. children involved then as well, yeah. so it's a, the role model approach that we're trying to take. <laughs> Excellent, well listen, you're very welcome to Australia. Thank you very much for I hope you us. enjoyed it. We get this up did. on your Facebook page and let's hope that'll inspire other people to take Brilliant. part as well. Brilliant, lovely to meet you and well thanks done. for accommodating us. Well, Brilliant, well thanks. Well <laughs>